Hey boys and girls, my name is Michelle Hutto. I'm a real estate broker and owner of Keystone Realty. My kids are Shelby Hutto, a junior, and Levi is a kindergartner, and Makala Hutto, she's in second grade. Hey guys. Today I'm reading you a book called Max Makes Millions. It's a cute, fun little book with little cutout holes. Hey guys. If you're a fish and out of shape, it's time you face the facts. You'll end at someone's dinner soon unless you come see Max. For when it comes to exercise performed beneath the surf, it's clear to fish most everywhere that this is Max's turf. From far and near, fish come to find the king of fitness fun who with his best friend Seahorse Sam will show you them how it's done. When leading their aerobics class, they really know what sells, like conga lines for hermit crabs to coax them from their shells. In blowfish class, Max makes them sweat. Just inhale, exhale, in. Now hold that pose, he firmly says, and see, you're all now thin. Wish it was that easy. Since healthy fish are grateful fish, they give Max lots of tips, like pearls and shells and pirate coins for firming up their hips. Not long ago, Max saved these tips in piles rich and swollen, but as treasure multiplied, he feared it might be stolen. He hid it first in oyster shells, at least that's what he tried, until he finally realized the oysters were inside. Next, he found a coral reef, all full of nicks and crannies, but all around were fishy eyes and even fishy fannies. Enemies were everywhere as Max began to panic. He feared that soon his fortune, too, could sink like the Titanic. Mm. He lugged his loot to Morris A., who practiced on his sax. The man array had much to say and gave it straight to Max. What you thinking, little man? Who needs that funky stuff? Just dig old friends. The Ray advice because plenty is enough. But Max was just not listening. A sign had caught his view. Bring yourself to a Sharky's bank. Our interest is in you. And there atop a single peak, a ship sat where it sank. Upon its golden letters glowed that spelled out Sharky's bank. Max paddled in and Sharky's bowed. Bonjour, my little morsel. He then shook each of Max's fins, the front ones and the dorsal. Your troubles have compounded, friend, the shark said looking grave. But come and look inside my vault. I'll show you how I save. Max peered inside the mighty safe and saw two million eyes. See y'all, my friends, grinned the shark. It pays to advertise. Best of all, they never leave. They make just one deposit. Then Shaky laughed and Lock maxed in, and none of them withdraws it. Max was trapped, but not for long. He organized those fish from side to side they exercised and made that old boat swish. It rocked and rocked and then it rolled right down the mountainside. And when it crashed, the fish swam free. Poor Sharky nearly cried. Max left the treasure where it lay, the coins and rings and lockets, because the day he realized a fish has got no pockets. And you can see what else Max learned from how the story ends. For Max is still a millionaire, he has a million friends. The end. This is Max's Feel Fabulous Workout. 
you find this book, you can do a workout too. It's got great exercise tips for everybody to do. Thank you. Bye kids. Bye McCullough. Bye Levi. Bye Shelby. Mwah.